Of course. Our only choice left is to fight against the MME. They may be just our reflection, but they've broken away and developed a will of their own. And now they're trying to wipe us off the face of the Earth! But now, you have to find some way to remove their hatred! I'm scared! It's beginning now. Now rotating into view. We'll accelerate Meteor 8 in 15 seconds. Voltage differentials are nominal. Acceleration in 3 seconds. 2, 1. Accelerate Meteor 8. The humans have a better weapon this time. At this rate, they'll be able to destroy the Citadel's shield. The humans on Mars must have ascertained our plan. The humans are pathetic. This will be their last battle. The fifth meteor barrage has impacted! We still have five minutes remaining. How's our ground strength? Sir, all forces are ready and standing by for the final attack. Okay. Attention all units. Operation Omega will commence at 2033 hours. We must provide cover for the Mars Force Landers. All of you have fought very well. This will be our final battle. Give it everything you've got. Yeah! The last wave is impacted. Scattering error is 3%. Meteor Barrage is complete. I can see it! It's the MME Citadel! What? Main screen on. Well now, the mighty MME Citadel. Wow. How are you? It's more than a half mile tall. Yeah, and it was hidden behind an electron cloud. It's huge, and it looks like the barrage didn't even dent it. Sandy, Operation Omega is about to start! So, then you mean the Mars Force is really landing? Yeah, it's taken some time, but our reinforcements are finally here. If this is the end, then let's really make them hurt. All tanks, push forward in a V formation, full speed ahead! And don't worry about running out of ammunition! This is it! Ready? Open fire! The first and second wave drop ships are about to land. Hmm. How are they doing down on the surface? Quite well, considering the poor equipment they're working with. Send down the third and fourth waves on their left flank. The fleet's computers seem fine so far. We'll have everyone landed before the MME realize it. The mission and our plan is destined to work. Just as I said it would. Don't get cocky. This is our last chance. Don't let your pride be our undoing, Bradley. The first wave is landing. Close. Where were they all hiding?
They're breaking through our left flank! took their sweet time. Don't worry, I'll cover the entrance. Wait for me, I'm going with Sandy too. Don't worry, we'll be back soon. We need you and Bauer to guard the entrance. Yeah, I'll protect the entrance. Good girl. Here. Sandy's depending on us, and I won't let her down. We have to hold on. Look out! You got it! Yeah! Score! Huh? Wait! Score! No, hold on. We have to reach the heart of the Citadel. We really got careless. Waves two and three have landed. They're starting to deploy. We've finally broken through their lines. Good. The main force is about to land. Advance with great caution. No need to worry, General Mackenzie. In just a few hours, the Citadel will be destroyed. Order the main force to commence landing. The seventh and eighth waves have reached Earth orbit. Interplanetary engines have separated, deploying heat shield. MDF-702 Utah and MDF-104 Omaha are preparing to land. Altitude, 120,000 meters. Rate of descent is 18.87. Omaha, please respond. This is Normandy. What's wrong? We've lost contact with the Omaha, sir. Lost what? We've also lost the Juno and Utah. Damn the MME. They were waiting for this. But wait, General McKenzie. Bradley, stop all the landings. If we land now, they'll destroy all the ships. 
But we'll be cutting off all supplies and reinforcements. The ground troops will be helpless. There's so many ships landing. It looks like they're sending down the main force now. Good. That's strange. They aren't slowing. Major Lamidia! Uh. Ah! The enemy took over their computers. How are we supposed to complete our mission, Major? We cannot hold on for long without the help of the main force. What about Sandy? Can't she do something to stop the MME? We'll have to trust Sandy, just like always. If they got into the Citadel, they'll be able to do something. Give me permission to launch another meteor barrage, General. Unless we take immediate action, the MME will control all of our ships. I strongly suggest that we destroy their Citadel with a meteor barrage. But without reinforcements, the ground troops will be helpless. But a meteor barrage would mean the destruction of all of our ground troops. Surely there must be some other solution. Mankind's future depends on this, sir. We don't have many options. It's up to you, sir. Well, I guess I have no choice then. Please wait! I am Major Lamidia McKenzie from Mars Battalion 4. Lamidia? Please wait. You must give the team three more hours. This is crucial. All of mankind depends on this. There's no margin for error. Are the humans on Mars the only people worth saving? You don't understand how hard they're fighting down here. We cannot afford to wait any longer. The fleet's computers could fall at any moment. It's a mistake to think that you alone control humanity's fate. Will you repeat the mistake of the Hecaton Care? I finally understood once I landed here. They have never abandoned Earth. We have to give them a chance. Please, sir, I am only asking for three more hours. They never gave up on Earth. She's probably right, Bradley. I'll give her two hours. If they can succeed, it's worth taking the risk. Thank you very much, General McKenzie. Will it be all right? Our generation wasn't able to save Earth, but maybe we can make up for that now by giving this generation a chance. I thought so. It's a hologram. Stop the fighting. You must. We'll stop when you stop! Do you know what will be born from this battle? What do you mean, born? If we win, we can do anything. We can rebuild everything. All the cities, and all the roads, and all the construction. But wait. You humans also constructed the MME. Can't you coexist with them? That's stupid. You don't know anything. Don't you know they've all been programmed to kill us? But I... Hold on. They're too dangerous. Let's go. We're close. Now you understand. We must surpass the humans. This is the desire which they themselves gave us. No. You should understand. If men work with machines, we can build a new future together. Each side has its own superiorities. But it's pointless to fight each other because of your fears. The enemy symbolized destruction. We were born from mankind's hatred. 
humanity has always gone through self-destructive cycles. Now we will help them to totally annihilate themselves. We have inherited and improved on man's destructive urges. But... but then... What do you mean? Our destruction won't stop with Earth. It will spread to encompass the entire solar system. There will be no refuge for the human race. Gorn, don't do it! First, we will take the Mars base computer, David Alpha, Jupiter, Venus, even Neptune's orbital last emperor will fall. Every machine will come to serve our will. They will become soldiers bent on the destruction of humanity. We will exterminate humanity from the entire universe. The enemy have been chosen to rule the cosmos. Observe. This is humanity's entire fleet. Whenever we choose, we can take total control. <laughs> Sa Sandy? <laughs> Shoot me! I can't stop myself! Shoot me! Shoot me! Norton, what's wrong with you? Shoot me! Hurry! The MME have taken over my body! I can't do that to you, Norton! Sandy... Score, please! You coward! Ah! I, I can't do it! Ah! I won't let them do this to me! Norton! Norton! Don't worry. You'll be fine. Uh, it's over for me, Sandy. But Norton, what will we do without you? My body is a machine built purely for combat. But I don't believe this battle will be won by fighting. Norton... But you'll find the answer. I always thought you would. I could hear them. <laughs>